Good afternoon. My name is Ida Jackson. On behalf of the research team, thank you for taking the time to meet with me. This interview will involve two parts. The first part is a brief, brief demographic survey, which you will be able to fill out via an anonymous digital survey. The second part will involve a brief set of questions about your perception and experiences with rooftop solar power. Our objective is to document the stories behind why people in Georgia do or do not adopt solar energy. There are no right or wrong answers. We want to he hear what you honestly think and feel. Um, before we get started, we have already completed a demographic um, form and we have also, you have consented to an audio recording, correct? That's correct. Okay. So let's get started. Can you tell me what type of home you live in? Um, a single family home. Do you rent or own your home? Own. Okay. An approximate date of when you moved in? We just moved this year, so 2019. Okay. Have you always lived in, in this community, Washington? Yes. How did your family end up here? Um, I was born and raised here. My mom, she was born and raised here, but my father moved here from Elberton. So. Okay. And they chose Brooks County instead of Elberton. Mm -hmm. Aren't you lucky? Yes, I am. <laughs> So you own your home. That's correct. Have you invested in solar? No. In any form? No. Either on your rooftop or on your property? Or no. Um, do you know if your utility company offers a program for solar? I wouldn't think they do because we're a rural area and we don't have a lot of options. So my guess would be no. Okay. Um, so tell me why you do not have this type of solar? Like I said, one reason would be being in a rural area. Our options are limited. Okay. And, you know, from my understanding, your solar will have something to do with your electric company. So that's one reason why I really hadn't put a lot of thought into it. But I have kind of seen different things like on the Internet or on TV about solar. Okay. So do you think, so do you, you don't think that the decision to have solar would be your, your That's correct. Decision. It wouldn't be my decision. Okay. But if I could get it, I would. Okay. So you just answered my next question. If you had the option, would you put rooftop solar on your home? Yes. And why do you think that would be? I think it would be a uh, energy saver. Right now, you know, in the rural area that we live in, the electric rates are higher than surrounding counties. Mm -hmm. So I think with the solar, it would definitely decrease the utility rates. Do you think that the utility company being privately owned would adopt? I wouldn't think so. Okay. Do you think there are any laws to protect you from that where they may not have a choice? They probably are, just don't know what they are. Okay. So let's talk a little bit about um, rooftop solar um, across the United States. Where do you, I'm going to give you a map. And on that map, I would like for you to shade in areas or area that you feel on um, rooftop solar is more prominent. I would think like areas that are desert areas where there's a lot of sunshine, you know, natural light, like mm -hmm. California, Arizona, even Texas will okay. probably be big areas. And even some places like, you know, Georgia, Florida, okay. those areas may be as well. All right. So we live in Georgia, um, and you said Georgia. What do you think? would make the people in those communities in those in those various states different I know just here. traveling through Georgia the state that that I live in mm -hmm. you see a lot of farms or um, businesses especially like the car industry okay. you see a lot of solar panels in okay. those type of facilities okay. so I think like I said farming is a big thing you know Georgia is considered a farm state mm -hmm. and then the reason why I said Florida is because you have Kind of like the California, you have a lot of sunshine. Mm -hmm. You do have some flat surfaces. So th okay. that's why I said Georgia and Florida. Okay. So you mentioned farms and businesses, car dealerships and things like that. Mm -hmm. So do you think solar um, panels are more prominent in residential or business? Right now I would say businesses. But okay. I think it's, it's slowly advancing into residential. And okay. I think eventually it will be very prominent okay. in residential. So let's look at the map for the state of Georgia. What 
communities in the state of Georgia do you think I would have more solar panels? Say maybe the Savannah area. Like, and the reason why I say their area, because like I said, you got farming, you kind of got the, the water in their area. Okay. Um, and then my next would probably be the Atlanta area. You okay. know, that's, you know, a very highly populated area. So residential, that may be an area that will start okay. doing the solar. So Atlanta pretty much sets the tone for what the rest of the state. Yep. Yep. Okay. Do you think people in those communities are different from people here in Wilkes County? I think they're more receptive to new ideas and okay. also your economy in those areas would be higher okay. than in rural areas. So the cost would definitely be an issue. So like I said, Atlanta Savannah, you got higher incomes and, you okay. know, the poverty level is not so high in those areas. So that's why I would say they would probably do better okay. starting out. All right. So um, for our last question, what about most of your close friends here in the state of Georgia? Do you do they have solar on their roof? No. Any discussions with anyone that may say why they do or do not? No. No. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's really not something that's like discuss or thought nah. of. Most of the time when you when I think of it, it's like I run across it. Like okay. like say on T V or I may see it in a store and it kinda crosses my mind then, but okay. not in general conversation. So would you say the awareness is low? Yes. Okay. All right. So thank you for taking the time to talk with me today and to do my interview. It was greatly appreciated. You're very welcome.